Yes people, myself TS Welcome back to another No Filter TS And North London is red We've known it's red But, you know, going to the Tottenham Stadium Has always been something that's, you know Been like, especially the new ground It's, it's been a thing of like, right, we just don't get results there And today's game was, was a comfortable win, you know Other than maybe what, the first 15-20 minutes of the second half When Spurs, you know, came out, came out on it um, It was a comfortable win, like you know, we had a chance early on with Enketia. You know, some might say he should have scored, but I think he did well enough to get his shot off on target. There was defenders behind Lloris anyways. Cool. Partey had an absolute scream of a shot that would have gone down as one of the best goals of the season. Hands down. You know, that post is probably still shaking now. Um, and then Saka, great work down that right hand side. He had Sessegnon and Toast. And then, you know, as as expressions will say, Hugo Lorray and Nephews. I don't know, man just fumbled the ball into the back of the net. Yes, it took a deflection, but the howler, then Odegaard, great second goal. And yeah, other than, like I said, the first 15 and the second half, I thought it was, it was comfortable. It was only at that point I was chatting to a couple of people and I was like, right, actually, you know, we might need a third. You know, if we get a third, we'll dead this game off. But the longer it went on, it just looked like, yeah, they ain't going to score. It's over. And then at the end, you know, it kicked off. Um, Richarlison, he's just not about it, bro. And then some dickhead fan wanted to kick Ramsdale. You know, look like he missed as well, little fool. He deserves to be arrested. Like, at least they said on Talksport, he deserves to be arrested and banned for life. And, yeah, man, Spurs are done out here, you know. You've got a manager that doesn't want to be there. Um, he's not committing to his future. Kane will go this summer, 100%. Um, and that's a club that needs a full-on rebuild, you know. Um, but <laughs> who cares? We we move on. There's eight points clear now, top of the league. Um I, we still need, you know, those reinforcements um, off on the bench. You know, people that can come to the side. Of, like, you know, fine. We missed out on Mudrich, you know, whatever the deal is. 60-something million plus something in bonuses. Just go to Palace now and just offer them 20 for Zaha. So be it, you know. I'm sure Zaha would be more than happy at this current moment in time to come in and feature in this Arsenal side and potentially win himself a Premier League medal in, in less than five months' time. You know, even Trossard. Then some people say, oh, we don't really need Trossard. But we just need more depth in that those, those attacking positions, you know. And it is where it is, man. Um, you know, we've come a long way from when we went to Spurs away last season, towards the end of last season, and we bottled it. And, you know, it was proper capitulation. And, you know, I've said it time and time again, you know, I've been a man that's been on Mikel's back, um, thinking, that, yeah, you know, he's not good enough. It's, it's time to go and that. But, you know, he, he's he's really, you know, proved me wrong this season. And... All you can do in them situations is hold your hand up to it. Obviously, the season's not over yet, but the way we're playing, you look literally. You look at look at our bench and stuff. And you'll be like, "Raw, oh, like, like we're doing we're doing wonders with this side," and like, like literally, kind of like limitations when you look at the bench and stuff. We're doing great stuff. So all you can do is credit the manager and, and the team for it. And long may it continue. You know, hopefully Spurs can um. Hopefully Spurs can take points off City and we beat United and then we're really laughing then. Um, but it's been, it's been a good weekend, man. You know, um, Liverpool got smoked. Um, you know, City lost. Tottenham lost. Win eight points clear. So great end to the, to the weekend. And, you know, it's going to be a tough one for certain football fans in the office tomorrow, but it won't be for me. So, yeah, man, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you haven't already done so, go hit that subscribe button now and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.